Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. So today in this video, we will see about Pondicherry. So come, let's start the video. So Pondicherry is situated in the southern part of India and it is one of the eight union territories in India. Pondicherry is often known as the Little France of India. The name is so because once Pondicherry was ruled by French people. So many people want to visit this wonderful place but they don't know that how many days are sufficient or some people just want to visit for a day but they don't know which are the places they should go. So in this video we are showing you that how many best places you can visit if you are planning to go to Pondicherry for a day. Actually there are so many places to visit in Pondicherry like Pondicherry is very famous for churches, uh, beach, so many beaches are there and there are French colonies. So many wonderful beaches here, the sunset and the sunrise are very beautiful to see in the beaches, beautiful cafes and many things are there. But in this video we will show you the best 3 or 4 places which we visited in a day. So if you want to know more about the Pondicherry, we already made separate video for Paradise Beach, Pichavaram Mangrove Forest, Oro Valley and so on. So we will give you the link in the description, you can go there and you can see the video separately. But in this video we will just talk about what are the places you can visit in a day. So I hope if you are planning to go to Pondicherry, this video is going to be a great help for you. So first of all you can see in our video, we started early morning from our home. So by 6.37 we reached Pondicherry Beach. So before we reach there, as you know that the vehicles are not allowed on the beach side. So we park our car nearby and we went by walk. So while going you can see here wonderful French colony. So one of the things you can visit here is the French colony which is also called the White Town. So the best way to explore the French colony is to go by walk or you can take a bicycle also. And you can hire a scooty or bicycle in Pondicherry, which varies from 500 to 2000. So you can see here in the video, these all are the French colonies. And the way they constructed their houses are very different from what we normally see in India. And we can see the French style over here. And another thing you can notice is they don't have tall buildings. Most of the houses are two storied and now they have converted most houses into hotels and cafes so that everyone can go enjoy and have fun there. So while visiting this place you won't feel like you are in India because the kind of architecture, the way they are making home and the, everything looks so different. And you can see many beautiful gardens and trees around the houses. So the another place to visit is Promenade Beach which is situated in the heart of Pondicherry city. So basically it is a 1.5 long beach and then bordered by a long walkway. Which means you can just have a walk also and you can see the beach. And there is no entry fee for this beach. So basically you can see here so many people come for a walk. So since we reached early morning, so we can see so many people walking and having exercises in this place. Vehicles are not allowed in this place during the evening time and even the morning. So that the people can just come and have a relaxed time over here. So you can see here this is a typical rocky beach and it looks very beautiful. And it looks very beautiful and it is one of the best beaches in India. See this beach is very beautiful and it's clean also. Since it is a rocky beach so we are not allowed to uh, swim or just play with the water but you can just go near the shore and you can just play for some time. So after we finish our breakfast we went to visit Oro Valley. So you can see here this is the way to Oro Valley 
and normally whenever you think about visiting pondicherry whenever you google it out you can see it. google will always suggest this place called oroveli and we have oroveli ashram and mandir and so many places but we normally went to oroveli and, and there we visited some of the shops and even the museum of this oroveli and you can see there's so many french and other non indian people staying there so here is the cafe so we went and had something in the cafe so one thing you can see here is that so there is nothing called domination everyone is super friendly here and then the things are also not very expensive so when you visit this place you must try some snacks and all they are super tasty after visiting that place we had our lunch then after that we went to the paradise beach so you can see here this wonderful paradise beach so this is a private beach normally but it is one of the cleanest beach in india and then here you can see very beautiful clean water and we can see the white sand over here so many huts are there many facilities are there and in order to go to this paradise beach you need to go to the boating so if you want to know more about paradise beach we have already made video at and the link is in the description so you can go through there and you can know about paradise beach properly since it is a private beach so you need to pay entry fee for here and then there are so many other uh, sports and other things so for that if you are interested you need to pay extra for that but if you are visiting pondicherry i suggest you to visit this place because you will see a different kind of beach over here very clean it's very healthy less crowded and so many other spots are there so you can have very good time from children to elder people everyone has some of the other activities to enjoy in this beach so these are the wonderful places we visited in a day and after having a lot of fun in the paradise beach we returned back home so guys thank you so much for watching this video i hope you like this video so please don't forget to like share and subscribe the channel